Hey guys, it's Mark from Music Greatness. In today's tutorial, we're going to be looking at Find Someone Like You. The introduction and first verse sound just like this. Alright, that was Find Someone Like You, the introduction and first verse. Let's break it down a little bit more. We're in the key of E, and we've got four main chords to look at. Our first chord is an E major 7 chord. That's E, G sharp and D sharp in the left hand, D sharp, E, G sharp and B in the right hand. Then we shift to a C sharp minor 9 chord. We've got C sharp, G sharp and D sharp in the left hand, D sharp, E, G sharp and B in the right hand. Then both hands move down to a B minor 9 chord. That's B and A in the left hand, C sharp, D, F sharp and A in the right hand. And finally, we shift to an F sharp minor 9 chord. That's F sharp and E, A, C sharp, E and G in the right hand. Let's recap those chords one more time before we take a look at the rhythm. To start with, E major 7, C sharp minor 9, then we shift both hands to B minor 9 and finally our F sharp minor 9 chord. Okay, now let's take a look at the rhythm. I'm going to start by counting out just the introduction, but the rhythm is identical in both the introduction and the verse. It sounds just like this. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Let's break that down bar by bar. We're going to start with our E major 7 chord. Our left hand is going to hold it for 4 beats. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and... And the right hand is going to play every half a beat. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and... Nice and simple. Then, just in our left hand, we shift down to that C sharp minor 9 chord. So the right hand stays exactly the same. Just watch out for that octave movement in the left hand. We're moving from an E to a C sharp. The rhythm is going to be exactly the same. Let me show you that now. So we've got our C sharp minor 9 chord. We're going to hold the left hand for 4 beats. And we're going to play the right hand on every half beat. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and... And back into our chord. This time we have our B minor 9 chord with the same rhythm. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. And finally, that F sharp minor 9 chord. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. And that's the complete introduction. Now let's take a look at the first verse. We're going to start on our E major 7 chord for 4. Then shifting to the C sharp minor 9. Then down to the B minor 9. And lastly to our F sharp minor 9 for 4. Then we're going to play almost the same thing but with a slightly different left hand and the right hand is going to have shift down an octave. Let me show you that now. We're going to start here. So we're starting with the exact same right hand position, that's our D sharp, E, G sharp and B, just like our E major 7 chord. But this time, the left hand is going to have an E and a G sharp. We're following the same pattern of 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and... Then, 
we're going to hold that right hand exactly the same, but in the left hand, we're going to play a C sharp and a G sharp and hold it for four. One and two and three and four and. And then we shift. Back to our normal B minor 9 chord. The only difference is that we're down an octave in the right hand. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. And lastly, we have our F sharp minor 9 chord, exactly the same in the left hand, down an octave in the right hand. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. And that's all there is to the introduction in the verse. Let's recap it at full speed so you can really see how everything fits together. Alright, that was the introduction and first verse of Find Someone Like You. If you enjoyed this tutorial and want to check out the rest of this video, please head over to musicgreatness.com to find out more. I've been your tutor Mark, thank you.